Hi, 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 hello, namaste. This is Mahi. Welcome to India. Glad to and right now we have a wonderful kitty. Bye. <laughs> Gayatri Bhardwaj is here. Let's talk with her. Hello. Thank you for having me. Namaste. Namaste. So, welcome to Hyderabad. Thank you. <laughs> uh, so, what's going on? Uh, lots of hectic things are going on. Promotions mm. are going on. Full-fledged for Tiger Nageshwara as you've mm. seen. Uh, we've been uh, going to different reality shows. We mm. have all the posters are up. Trailers, fantastic. Mm. And uh, just the excitement is building up now for the mm. release. So yeah. So this is my first thought when I'm seeing you. Uh, I just want to tell you one thing. I wish I was your mirror so that I could like at you every day morning. What what what? Uh, I wish I was your mirror so that I could like at you <laughs> every day How morning. How sweet! Oh my god, I'm flattered. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> and you have a great curve. I mean, smile curve. Thank you. Thank you so much. You're so nice. Like right in the beginning of the interview, you've just brightened my day. <laughs> it's everyday thing for me. But then this is so special because of Gayatri Bhatt's watch. Oh, thank you. It's really special for me too because it's my first film. Mm. And uh, doing interviews to promote my first film is surreal because, mm. you know, we worked so hard on it. And it's been <coughs> four years in the making, as you know. The film mm. has, yeah, mm. the director has written the film for the past four years mm. and uh, he's been at it, so much research, so much hard work has gone behind this film. So, yeah, you know, it's very, very special yeah. for me. So, and one more thing, have you heard, I mean, this name before entering into the film Tiger Nageshwar Rao? So, you know, I have not heard of mm. this name ever before because, simply because thieves are not glorified mm. in, in our lives, in the world, right? Mm. So this, as you know, Tiger Nageshwar Rao was the most, uh, you know, terrifying thief and the most crazy, like, uh, yeah, story yeah. of a thief, mm -hmm. which existed, which is, and of course, this story is based on true rumors, as mm -hmm. you have seen, mm -hmm. the tagline is, uh, because there is no solidified facts, there are no written mm -hmm. documents that have gone, this is all about what people know, like, he's a legend, basically. So, uh, yeah, I'd never heard of him before, because, of course, thieves are not glorified, as I said, so... Mm -hmm. But ultimately, I feel like now when the film is coming out, people are going to know about this person. So, yeah. And they also titled the India's Biggest Thief. India's Biggest Thief? Yeah, he was. Uh, but compared to Raithi Chagar, you are the biggest thief. Why? <laughs> <laughs> you stole my heart right now. <laughs> Seriously. Now yeah. the audience who is watching, they are going to be like, you are hating on guy. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Yeah. So, positivity is uh, Ramba important right yeah, now, yeah, so that's course, why. Course. So, how's you working with uh, Ravithya Chagaru while shooting on the sets and all? Uh, is there any crazy moments happening? Uh, lots, lots of crazy moments, but most of the things were basically me being very nervous mm. and him telling me, it's alright, it's okay, you've got it. And you know, he's a very positive person. Mm -hmm. He's extremely energetic mm -hmm. so I never felt like there was any dull moment around him because whenever he walks on set he just walks firstly he walks very very fast mm -hmm. he's tall and you know he walks fast he reaches the set and he's like chop chop he means mm -hmm. business mm -hmm. and he will stand there and without any time he just gets into the character and mm -hmm. starts performing like for an actor like myself because I'm just starting out yeah, yeah. it takes I need to sit and meditate for 10 minutes before I need to get in the character, I need to say some affirmations, mm -hmm. then go on set, then do all of that, you know, and he's just like, it's so much a muscle memory for him, because mm -hmm. years and years, he's a superstar. Mm -hmm. So, I feel like I got to learn so much from him on set. Why do you want to control your stress and anxiety while before shooting on the... Yeah, of course. Because mm. it's so nerve-wracking to work with such a big superstar and mm. you have to match up to his standard, no? Mm. Otherwise, if, imagine firstly Telugu language is mm. new to me. Learning the lines, yes. So, I had learned the lines three months in advance. Mm. I had to, mm. there was no choice. And uh, then I came on set and then to match up to him is what the challenge is, right? I don't want people to be like, mm, she fell flat, there was no. So, there's that pressure also because I'm just entering the industry. So, yeah, I had to do all that. <laughs> Oh, three months before preparation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You did it. Okay. Definitely. And you did some, one film in Hindi. Yes. This is your first debut Telugu film, yes. right? Yes. And what's your first thought when you enter it into the sets? I mean, everyone will speak in the, Telugu yeah. and Tamil. And it's rushing everywhere, right? Yeah. What's your feeling on that time? So, when I, uh, on set, basically, I could hear, it's like, 
a lull like a voice that's going on like i'm not understanding anything because so many people are speaking at the mm. same time mm. so i was not understanding anything but then when i started paying attention i heard i understood that you know these words probably mean this mm. so mm. now at least i understand the context of what is being spoken so mm. people cannot fool me anymore if you're talking in telugu with somebody i'll know if you're talking about me <laughs> earlier i didn't but now i know. so that okay. much i have learned Is he prankster? I mean, the in the concepts are. <laughs> <Huh? laughs> he is very funny. He is mm. very funny, mm. uh, but he's not, you know, had any done any pranks on me. Luckily, uh. because I would have cried. I would have been like, sir, don't do that. <laughs> so he's uh. not done that to me. But mm. yeah, I guess he is to other people. <laughs> <laughs> And uh, we all know because uh, after seeing the trailer, it's a grand year of the film. I mean, uh, Tiger Nagi Sir is all about the grand year of sets and all. Yeah. Uh, can you please tell me the how the sets and all? What? Okay, so uh, my I'm playing a villager's character, mm-hmm. right? I thought that there was going to be a hut for me. Mm. that as a set that i am mm. staying here or some things around it mm-hmm. but there was a whole village created mm-hmm. that is how big the sets were mm-hmm. and i remember going on set and being like okay so maybe this is the way to the set but that itself was a set so it was huge the sets you know and once i figured out that even the uh, the bhed bakriyan and the animals everything is a part of the set with the people like it was so authentically done mm. and they had to do it because you know we are play we are showing showcasing 1970s 1980s mm. uh mm. india during the emergency period you know when everything was in an upheaval so this needed to be very authentic for people to believe that this has been shot back then mm. so uh, i feel like now the art direction team has done a fantastic job at mm. creating the sets and to create the feel you know that rustic village feel and to create that 1970s prehistoric kind of an era so uh, yeah the sets were beautiful and i think once the film comes out people are going to be able to enjoy mm. it in its uh, entirety mm. so before entering into telugu films have you uh, ever seen the telugu films and have you ever seen that i feel like ever, of yeah, yeah, yeah of course i have mm. uh, ever since Bahubali came out. I feel mm. like it became a sensation. Mm. Telugu films came in the world mm. stage, mm. you know, yeah, because Bahubali yeah, yeah, was yeah. so big. And Raja Mali sir, I'm a big fan of. R R R was spectacular. Pushpa, I have watched. So these are all those big films that you know have not only penetrated mm. the Telugu audiences but have really gone deep into the north, into actually the entire world. It's not just Hindi film industry that the world knows. now mm-hmm. it's telugu film industry as well we are the indian film industry now. yes 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 so i feel like i'm very lucky to be entering this industry at at, mm. at a time where it's firstly doing so well mm. and it's not like good cinema was not there before it's just that it had not reached a larger audience things were things had not been dubbed in hindi it was not a pan india situation earlier right mm-hmm. but after bahubali happened like thousand crores and the numbers were insane So yeah, I'm very happy and proud to be uh, associated with the Telugu industry. Okay, do you expect this film also will create the numbers? I mean, the Bollywood box office numbers. Definitely, we are yeah. very confident. We definitely are, and yeah. I have spoken to my producers and my director, yeah. everyone. Like we are so confident in the product. Yeah. We are very confident that people are going to. enjoy ravi sir in a never before seen avatar he is usually doing his comedy and action mm, and mm. dancing and like you know his comic timing and everything here you're going to see him in an epic mm, avatar mm, like mm. he's so badass he is kicking ass of people that are doing him wrong <laughs> so you will never see him like this i don't mm. know in the future or not but here this is a never before seen thing so i know his fans are going to die when they watch him on screen and even people who have not watched his films up north or wherever Actually, I, I haven't met anyone who has not, by the way, seen his films. But uh, I'm very excited. I think people are going to love it. I mean, which stars you know about from from Telugu uh, films? Ram Charan, I'm a big fan of. After <laughs> watching R R R, the first scene, okay, when he entered and he was doing, I said, "Who is that? Who is that?" <laughs> I was so impressed. Mm-hmm. And um, of course, Alu Arjun is spectacular. Mm-hmm. Um, then there is uh, Nani. There is. Uh, mm-hmm. 
Rana Dagubati, there is so many like Chiranjeevi sir, Pawan Kalyan sir, like I know so many of them who are mm -hmm. creating, who have been iconic, like legendary people. Mm -hmm. So and I hope to work with them as well. So Gatri Gar, nowadays language has no barriers because the film is going to be released in every language and it creates some sensations in every time, I'm in every uh, language. But what is your thought when you entered into South Films, uh, before you entered into South Films and after you entered into South mm -hmm. Films, did you observe anything uh, like how they created the films, how they created the uh, things going to be happen? Yeah, very. Uh, so the thing is, I am not just doing any South film. I'm mm -hmm. doing an iconic South film as my mm -hmm. first film because mm -hmm. it was this, the budget was very big. Mm -hmm. uh, overall, the level of the film is not that of the film that I did in Hindi because we were two newcomers who mm -hmm. did it in Hindi and of course it was a smaller scale film, simpler sets, uh, we shot in real locations over there. Here, I feel like because the the level of the film was so big mm -hmm. that there were of course lots of differences like every scene was shot like in one day we would probably shoot half or one scene, not even mm -hmm. one scene because mm -hmm. so many junior artists are there, yeah, there's yeah. so many people, so so much as like if there's an action scene, mm -hmm. like overall the scale is so large that I feel like we took our time to shoot it. We, mm -hmm. I think I've been on the film in for a year now and uh, shooting a film over one year would be just me, imagine Ravi sir how much he must have shot, mm -hmm. right? Like obviously I have not shot all year, I've shot 20-25 days in a year. But it, it's here in South, I have noticed that it's done with a lot of patience. People are very uh, mm. particular about every single frame, every single. That's why, like films like Bahubali mm. and uh, you yeah, know all those yeah, other yeah, films yeah. are so larger mm. than life because you can tell that every frame they have sat down and they have made sure that it's perfect. Yeah. You know, so that's when a film is iconic. Mm. So I feel like that's what we have tried to do here as well. Our director Vamsi sir, he is. Especially with me, uh, as an actor, he was very sure that I want you to be... Now, if I'm flirting with you, mm -hmm. for example, okay? You would expect me to do it like this, like that. He said, no, you're a tomboy. <laughs> Your character is a tomboyish character. You cannot be feminine here. Mm -hmm. You could be like, hey, like that, you know? And I'm not used to that because I'm a very girly girl in real life. Mm -hmm. Plus, I'm speaking in a different language. So, I had to... I don't know if you've seen my song from mm -hmm. the film. Mm -hmm. That song, I am, the way I'm dancing, you can tell that this girl is not a feminine girl. She's a must like villager and she does whatever she wants. So yeah. our director is very specific about that. So it takes time, mm. you know, to, uh, to get things right, which is why now when it's releasing, we're like, mm -hmm. finally that day has come. I feel like I'm birthing a child. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously? Yeah, yeah. I can understand. I can understand. Okay, uh, one wish right now. Okay. okay. So, uh, just now you told that I mean you are the tomboy in the character in yeah. Tiger Nagasura. So uh, please let us know how how is that character in one dialogue. If you want to flirt me, is that? <laughs> oh my God! A dialogue I don't uh, remember. Uh, I should come prepared with yeah. that, but. Mm. My character is Mani. Ah. Her name is Mani. And uh, she loves this dude. She is in love with uh, Nagi, ah. Tiger Nageshwar Rao. Okay. And uh, they know each other like, uska bachpan ka pyaar hai. Mm -hmm. Since she was a kid, she's been in love with him. Mm -hmm. And now that she's grown up and she's idolized him and she's fantasized about him. Mm -hmm. But he, you'll, you'll see in the film that it takes time for them to come together. Mm -hmm. Whether they will come together or not, that also we don't know. Mm -hmm. That you will see in the film. But her love for him is unending, unwavered, mm -hmm. unaffected by anything else in the world. So she's a lover girl, fully. And she is obsessed with the doing things for him, getting noticed. They say, that's a chulbuli ladki. She's that. <laughs> chulbuli ladki. Chulbuli. <laughs> and <laughs> she loves attention. And uh, mm. but mm. also, hai to wo gaon ki usko nahi aata kaise patate hain ladke ko kaise karte hain. To wo apne zone mein hai. Usko jo aata hai wo wo karti hai. So uh, yeah, that's my character, Mani. And uh, maza aega aapko dekh. Maza aega. <laughs> 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 Super, thank you so much, guys. Thank you. And all the best for your uh, entire journey. Thank you so much. I hope that you love the film as well. Basically, that's Mas Maharaja film.
Do you know about him, his title? Yeah, yeah, of course. Who does it? Mass Maharaja he is. Like yesterday at the event, people were going crazy. Like mm-hmm. the way they were screaming. I couldn't hear my own voice. That's how loud it was. <laughs> so that's it, guys. This is Ajay Mahesh signing off.